I've got an Ipsy bag. I don't know what's in here. If you want to find out with me, stay tuned. Hi, and welcome to our channel. My name is Tracy. Bandit's hanging around somewhere. I don't know where he went off to. Um, and Chloe's at home, but if you're new, welcome. Thanks so much for checking us out. We do all kinds of unboxings, unbaggings, get ready with me's, cooking, collaborations, all kinds of fun stuff. So if you're into that kind of thing, please consider hitting the subscribe button. And if you're returning, thank you so much for being a part of our YouTube family. So I'm filming this on March 1st. This came in today. Um, I would be blown away if it was my glam bag. Blown away. Okay. No, I don't think it is, but I don't know what it is. Oh, whatever it is, it's wet. Okay. Um, I think this was the little set that I ordered. And I ordered it because of the green stuff here, which is a truly beauty. And it looks like something's exploded. So if you can, I don't think you can see the wet, but my hands are wet, wet, wet. I'm guessing the face mask leaked. And even being in this bag, it seems to have leaked through. Um, because this is a scrub set, so I don't imagine it's from this. Let's take a look at this. Nope, this is a lip scrub. And a little lip scrubber. I got this, I think I got this for $3.50, maybe $5. And then this set I picked up for the Truly Beauty item in here. There is a 111 Skin Mask. Yep, look, it's pierced right there. 111 Skin Face Mask. These are like $20 each. So I am definitely going to contact them and let them know and take a picture of that. When you get a defective product from Ipsy, um, I'd say or BoxyCharm, but you've only got one month left of getting that defective product from BoxyCharm and then it's all Ipsy. You are going to want to take a picture of the product and your shipping label with your address and everything as best you can. Get it all in that picture because when you go on their site to report it, you'll start with their bot and it will ask you, do you have a photo? Upload the photo. If it doesn't ask you to upload the photo, when somebody emails you, they're going to ask you for a photo. So make sure you get both and also look online with your order number before you even report it because they're going to ask you for your order number. So that is important information. Ipsy is generally pretty good about um, replacing the product. BoxyCharm used to be, but in the past, oh, there's Bandit. In the past several months, I think in preparing for their merge with Ipsy, they've been just giving out charms that they couldn't refund you. So, they're not going to refund me for that part of this bundle. Um, all right. So the other thing in here is by Truly Beauty. It's the Matcha Scrub. It's a whipped face scrub. And I am, I adore Truly Beauty. Here it is. It smells divine. It is like, it kind of has like a marshmallow feel to it. There it is on my hands. This is definitely like a rougher scrub. So this is not the kind of thing you would want to use every day. Um, it's the kind of thing you would use on occasion. Um, it has green tea, matcha, um, dead sea salt, and vitamin A boost. So, but I do love their brand. I love the colors. I love the scents. I just love this brand. It is a pricey brand, so when I can catch it on a good sale on Ipsy, I'm always going to go for that. As a matter of fact, with my recent BoxyCharm box, I had a choice between the Drunk Elephant Scalp Serum, which I was like, oh, that looks amazing, or a Truly brand. 
which I did not get. It was the truly one that came in Glam Bag X that I didn't get. And it was an exclusive to Ipsy or BoxyCharm. And I went with that. And there were two reasons for that. One was because it was a Truly product and um, one that I couldn't go out to the store to get. But the other one is that I did get um, a Sunday Riley scalp serum treatment that I really liked from Ipsy about a year or so back. And um, it did not, I don't think it was good. It smelled like a tire factory. And I was pretty sure that that was not how it was supposed to smell. But nobody got back to me about it. I was a little bit mad about that. Um, cause I was like, I just think there's something wrong with it. Um, all right. Well, that's what I got in my add-ons. Um, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts about the BoxyCharm and Ipsy merger. I, for one, am not upset. And I'm going to tell you why. Because this is going to save me about $60 a month. Um, uh, because I was getting the Glam Bag, the Glam Bag Plus, and then when it was available, the Glam Bag X instead of the Plus. And then on BoxyCharm's end, I was getting the Base Box, the um, Premium Box, and when it was available, the Lux Box replacing the Base Box. So I'm saving money. I'm not getting the um, Glam Bag Plus, so that's $28. I'm also not, plus $2 shipping, right? So you're really looking at $30. The premium box from BoxyCharm, that was $40 with shipping. So the way they're doing it is you're going to have the glam bag, little, you know, $13 bag plus $2, so let's call it $15. you are going to get the um, BoxyCharm by Ipsy. That's going to be your base box. They're not offering a premium. They're offering a boost my box for $15 extra, and that's going to be one um, kind of like high price item that they're going to give you for $15. So like in my Glam Bag X, I did say, well, whatever, I'll give it a try. And I got a Drunk Elephant product. So that was like an $82 value. So I thought that was a pretty good investment. And I've been wanting to try that product. Well, wanted to try anything by Drunk Elephant, but I wasn't going to spend $82 on one product. So, um, and then the Icon bag, which... I'm thinking is going to replace your boxy charm on those months, but maybe not. The way they had everything worded, like it wasn't even clear. I wasn't sure if they were even going to have a premium or not. But from what I'm making out, there won't be a premium. Um, and I'm thinking that that icon box is going to re quarterly replace the boxy charm box. Um, because it would typically do that with the Glam Bag X. So well, let me know your thoughts on all of that though. Again, I'm, I'm excited because it's going to save me a good amount of change and I have had to uh, make some very hard decisions about subscriptions. Um, there are some that I absolutely love that I have had to um, put on pause because um, it's just, I'm overwhelmed with product and um, I get to save some money, you know? My kid wants to go to camp in the summer. She's going to want to go to college. I got, I got to put some money in the bank. I can't be putting it all on my own, you know, enjoyment. So, um, so that's why we have kind of increased the um, cooking, you know, increased other content. Um, cooking, get ready with me is reviews, things like that. Um, some mask days we're going to be doing um, to be able to review different products too. All right. Well, thank you so much. And hopefully I'll see you soon.